uh, LA has less species of heroin than on the sidewalk. Yeah. That's not true. You are wrong, sir. <laughs> I'm going to tell you right San now. San Francisco. What's going on, everybody? Hope everyone's having a fantastic evening, afternoon, pre noon. No matter where you are in the world, I'm Hassan Piker, and this is the Hassan Abbey Broadcast coming to you live from sunny Austin, Texas. Hell yeah, 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 brother. Raise hell and praise Dale out here, brother. Hell f yeah. That's right. Yeah, so we're not doing a fashion stream for Misgift, but instead we're doing a fashion stream for f me, right. Will. I want to dress up like a Texas Village person. Yeah, we're like the locals. And this is... Well, like the group, the village people. Oh, 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 okay, like, well, you can't like do the... Kind of half leather daddy. You want to do Native American, is what you're saying. No, no. That's uh, that's illegal. I want to do, do the that. biker guy. What you're the fucking, fuck? You're fucking canceled, dude. No. Wait, wait a minute. This is NMP Law's very own Nick. Hello. This shirt that you got on same. says same, but, yeah. like, it makes you look like an ROTC kid. Where's ROTC? Like, the fucking uh, military Future thing. Marine. Yeah. Oh, really? In, in schools. How do you not know what ROTC is? I know what, you know, YMCA is. Hey, Asana, how you doing? Hey, there he is. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are now in, we're now in a different territory. It's one that I've never been inside of. All right, I've got a fucking mask on. Also, he's, uh, he's Austin. He's blended in with the fucking crowd cover. by cover. not wearing a mask, yeah, but looking as gay as possible. <laughs> So not very undercover. I to, guys, I have to offset my outfit with no mask. I mean, I'm going to take mine off, too. Okay. There's a nice leather. There's a nice leather smell here. Probably from the fucking boots. This is what I fucking look like. Like a goddamn fucking savage. Hey, what's going on? Okay, okay. so this might shock you. Okay, here it is. We're not from Texas. <laughs> okay, how did you know that? Okay. Yeah, I, I mean, I know you're shocked. You're, you're still like, what? These guys are very clearly local. But, so, we're here, so we want to blend in. So, obviously, in order to blend in with the local crowd here, we needed to get Texas ripped out. You know yes. what I'm saying? So, that's why we're out here. But, like, rodeo drip. Like I want, yeah, like, just a... Just, like, you know, what normal Texas people wear, obviously. Which but is like... the full rodeo outfit. This is very nice, by the way. It's good material. It's, like, heavy. I think that's uh, for fires. It's for fires? Yeah, like fire Okay, you look like you're wearing your big brother's coat. <laughs> yeah, he's like my big brother. Oh, dude, turn around and close it. He's like my Turn around and close it, Austin. Shooter. I'm wearing his outfit for the day. No, close it, close it. You look like two kids trying to sneak into a movie right now. Like like one kid on another kid's shoulders. That's funny. Yeah, this is, I'm never gonna be able to put this on. It's just like way too. This is, this is not gonna happen. Because there's no ease of access into this. Movie. If you want to call him a pussy at any moment during the yeah, you can go process, ahead. I am a pussy, ahead. but I like. Yeah, put it on. It's just not gonna. It's not gonna happen. Come on, pussy, put it on. I mean, I'll try, but it's. Ooh, that one I like the design on too. What yeah. Maybe. How much is this? Is this ostrich? Six hundred and seventy-nine dollars and ninety-nine cents. Okay. Oh. Oh, that's snake skin right there. Oh. Is crocodile. Crocodile. Yeah. Crocodile one right now. God damn. Yeah. What if I? Can I do one of these like a? Like you a, are gonna pop an ACL. Yeah. <laughs> a little boot scooting boogie. Yeah. Oh. You're just new boot goofing. I'm new boot goofing right now. <laughs> she has a look of disgust in her face. She looked at me like, this is the worst thing I've ever seen. Wait, there's an doing? America one. Is that an American flag? She on? said, she said, no. Oh <laughs> she was my concerned. God. She was concerned. Are you kidding me? That's a good one. Those are work boots. What? They're work boots. They're work boots? I'm a working man. You got some good ass tunes in here. Oh my god, what the fuck is this? This shit, I would wear this though. It's embarrassing, but okay. Oh, this is sick, dude. This is like, I mean, this is hipster as fuck. This is like LA hipster. It looks pretty good. If I get the dust, they're in this. Like, I literally have to get a sawed off shotgun. Like, I just it, to complete the outfit. Which one says? <laughs> which one is the most hate crimey one? <laughs> Love it or leave it. That's great. It's got the fucking Pennsylvania oh, bell, though. Land of the free. You see that one in the back with a big eagle insignia? That um, one's pretty. Oh, this one. <laughs> that's uh, <laughs> that's <laughs> interesting. That's an interesting one. Yeah. Yeah, because he wants something that 
So what I was looking for, there's like the Wrangler ones back there, you know the black ones, they're straight black. Mm -hmm. If it had like white accents or something like that, not like this aggressive, something, you know, something I could wear in, in Austin as well as Los Angeles. Happy medium. Which man. is basically like Austin now. I, I mean, Austin is basically like L.A. now. No, it's more like San Francisco. Yeah. LA, has, uh, L.A. has less species of heroin dealers on the side. Yeah. That's not true. You are wrong, sir. <laughs> I'm going to tell you right San, now. San Francisco, San Francisco, Seattle, and we Austin We, we certainly have a... We got certainly have that as well. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's so bad, dude. I grew up, I grew up here, and it's just like, I look around, like, I can't even afford a house now because everyone moved here from California. Yeah. Like, all, even all the way out to Leander... And almost Liberty Hill, which is about 34 miles up. For us, it's still almost 300,000. For us, 300,000 is ridiculous. For us, I see a house here that's like six hundred thousand dollars. I'm like, that's a three million dollar home in any part of like oh, yeah. Los Angeles. For sure. Uh, so like, no matter what, that's like a steal. When in fact, the house's real cross probably would have been like three hundred, four hundred thousand dollars oh, max. Sure. I just like, hate it. What happened also too is like it's also the reason why there's so many homeless people. Yeah, it's because they're getting all priced out. California wildfires that put people out of houses, so they yeah. moved here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The only thing I don't like about this, so I'm almost 40 years old, I'm 38. Mm -hmm. Damn. I grew up in high school. You look good as hell, dude. <laughs> yeah, for that. <laughs> yeah. That's right. Uh, I remember growing up in high school and people would move here because I, I grew up in a Dallas Fort Worth area. Right? Yeah, and so people were moving to California from Dallas a long time ago before they came here. Right, and you know everyone made fun of Texas. It was, it was beer, you know, listen, Texas, beer, steers, and queers. Yeah. Everyone, remember that? Remember that saying? Oh, I, I, I would yeah. used to say it. Yeah. I used to say it. Beer, steers, and queers, Texas, there ain't nothing. Now, all, all of a sudden, yeah. that everyone decided to vote wrong for 20 years I and know. put their hand on the hot fire, now yeah. all of a sudden, it's yeah. like, wow, oh, this place is nice. I ain't ever leaving. It's great. Yeah. That's the only, yeah. that's the only thing that burns me yeah. about it. Like, anything yeah. that there's a fence around Texas, you can't move here. Yeah. If jobs are coming here, you're going to move. Yeah. I, I get that. That's fine, but at the same time, it's like I'm old enough to remember when California did nothing but make fun of things. Yeah, well, I, well, me too. I mean, well, well. California was red back then. Yeah. Yeah. Now Texas is gonna turn blue. I hope not. Ah, yeah. I don't know, man. I don't it's it's, it's gonna be interesting. Well, to see. I hope not either. But there's a lot of people moving from California that went away from the circus too. I, well, I, so they're voting red. I hope not. It's yeah. I hope that's what I'm saying. They're all moving out here to vote red as they should. As they should. Absolutely. There's still a large. What are you talking about? As they should. No, they absolutely should. Statistically speaking, that's all I'm gonna say. More Texans, uh, more like generational Texans, voted for the Democrat this last time around yeah, than but Ted Cruz. Except because well, the new that. the new people that are coming into Texas are like, yeah, we're going to vote Republican. Yeah. And they're over the top. Hoorah. When like most Texans are just like, I just, you know, want to live and have regular, a regular so, real yeah. estate I market. Want, I, 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 just want, I, I just want my gas back yeah. to $2. Exactly. Yeah. Me too. Exactly. Exactly. That's, That's what I'm saying, man. Fuck that guy. He's, and, he's bare, and he can't even talk. Yeah. Do you no, see I that? I, I can't put a sentence earlier. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Yeah. That? Well, my thing, my, my, my thing is, if the, if, 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 if the liberal vote is working, yeah. then everyone's not leaving the West Coast and the East Coast to come to the That's what I'm country. saying. It's the Democrat run. We don't, we don't have 75 thing, degree weather. We I know, don't have the, beaches. The thing people don't realize. The thing that people don't. You're coming here because you can unsustainably continue to vote that way and maintain. But the thing that people don't realize is the liberals in California aren't. Fucking progressive. They're they're dog shit. They are they are worse than the Republicans in fucking Texas. If what, you're the, being real. Yeah, they don't they don't give a shit. There's like the reason why there's so much homelessness and you are you nailed it when you talked about it, is because of the unfettered growth and the, the unregulated housing market that's pricing people like yourself and others outside. Now Texas you going for, for Yeah, now but Texas has unlimited like, real estate basically, so it doesn't really matter. So you can always like move further and further away. Yeah, we don't have But then a lot of people but but then after a certain point cuz California has a fuckload of real estate too it's a massive state the problem is yeah but who's been running the state for you, know? you can't you you're not going to be able to the state was bankrupt the last time no it's probably that's not right. it's no it's not we had a we had a surplus we had a 58 billion dollar surplus this time around yeah but where to go what do you mean it's, it's still there no we have a 58 right, billion dollar surplus i'll tell you why people i'll tell you why people are, a lot of people are homeless right now think about this if i was if i was an alcoholic and there was a st there was a state or a city that I could move to that abolished DWIs. I moved there. Wait, what? They abolished DWIs? No, I'm saying I'm saying think about it. if I was, I'm just using an example. If I was an alcoholic and I could move somewhere that abolished DWIs, I'd move there. My point to that is is that you have a lot of people who want to be able to do drugs. You have people who actually enjoy living in the streets and doing it. And now you know. Hey, when I go to Dallas, they saw you shoot up. 
They yeah. patch you down. They put you up against the wall. They patch you down. They take your drugs. They put you in jail like Austin's trying to pretend like they did because they realize that you're not going to be able to pay your way out or do anything. They patch you down and take your drugs. Now in Austin, you shoot up in the middle of the street, throw your needle down, you're good to go. No, it's that, that's a junkie's paradise, sir. Yeah. You're not getting patted down no. and you're not taking your drugs. No. You, you can do it in broad daylight now. You don't have to go in the alley and hide. No, I know. And, and you can have your. T- that's that. That's that. If All I'm gonna say is if that's your mentality of life. That is a paradise. That's like saying. That's yeah. almost like legalizing crap. Yeah. I mean, because you can now do it in broad daylight well on, the, on the side. But, but the places that have actually decriminalized it, like countries and shit, like Portugal, have been able to deal with it a lot better because. What you're normally supposed to do is treat addiction like a disease. You don't have any addicts in your family. So uh, instead of criminalizing it and like punishing people that are addicts because they're fucking addicted, what are you going to do? What you're supposed to do is take them off the streets and get them the help that they need. Put them in a Correct. clinic and like allow them to That's heal themselves. That's what they do in San Antonio. They bought all those big houses and they put people in there. And then what they do is they give you like a kind of like a GED program that you can go through and yeah. trade. So when you come out of there, not only are you clean and sober, but you have a little bit of a degree that you can go into a job. 100%. That's but, what you're supposed to do. But why do you think when you go to San Antonio, there's no homeless people down there? Because they don't want that. They probably brew, <laughs> They'd mean, rather be in Austin. Where if, you don't, do if you don't see homeless people anywhere, it's probably because cops are beating the shit out of them. Let's be real. <laughs> like, that's what that's well, literally maybe. it. Maybe. Well, yeah. Well, or at least John push him out of the main yeah. main, main section. Yeah, one hundred percent. Let's hope. Let's hope Texas stays Texas. I hope so. You are. Su- he's such a liar. I'm just letting you know. He voted for Biden, and he would have done it twice illegally. He's full of shit. Uh, Texas will stay Texas. I'll tell you why. Because when it goes too far crazy, there's more lead in this state. We'll spray so much fucking lead in this state. Everyone. I know. I don't know, I'm just man. waiting for something crazy to happen to where like we have to take it back to where we have to like force them. How are you gonna? How are you? Oh, listen. How are you gonna fucking justify voting for Ted fucking Cruz? He's the worst, dude. I'm not a big Cruz fan. Yeah, I'm everyone big, says that, I'm but a, then I'm they a, end I'm up voting big. for him because I mean, Beto is not uh, great either. But like, Beto is trash. But goddamn, Ted Cruz is so whack. Like, I'm, a, I'm not a big Cruz fan. He's such a fucking lame. You ever see John Brennan's uh fucking brisket? Mm-mm. The one that he, the one that he made, is embarrassing. I'm just saying, like all these, like, yeah, listen, I'm a big, I'm these a big are all, I these do are like all, that, the- these are all fucking. Yale graduates that fucking are on the debate club and then they come in here and they wear the fucking snakeskin boots and go, oh yeah, I love Texas. And then half the fucking Republicans vote for them. Even though they're fake as fuck, they don't give a shit, they fly out to Cancun when the fucking power grid is down and then blame it on their daughters, which is the most cowardly thing you can do. That's why I love Trump, man. He was so good at just, he put America first and did not care if it made you upset. That's what we need, man. That is exactly what it should be. Your feelings does not mean a fucking thing to me. There's a bottom line. You don't go into a store and say, hey, can I buy this belt buckle with my feelings? You buy it with money. (laughs) He put the money back in the situation. He put that first and everyone got in their feelings about either anything he tweeted or whatever, which I agree sometimes he's tweets were a little, uh, I can live without some of them as well. But what I'm saying is that guy was such a put America first and didn't care. The only thing I, I liked about Trump is, is I, I how 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 much of a catty I bitch was he so was. Uh, why'd you snitch? I was on his side first. No, motherfucker. Yeah, I'm not letting you get away. You're like, oh yeah, I'm lo- yeah, I hate them. I was into it. Uh, I, yeah. gotta, I gotta blend in. Oh, that's oh, sick. Yeah. It's got short sleeve and everything. That's, that's exactly what I'm looking for. Yeah, it's not Wrangler, but... No, no, it doesn't have it. to be Wrangler, yeah, but this is it's, good. It's not as loud as the one shirt you asked for. No, no, I don't want it to be loud. This is it. perfect. What are you doing over there? You're fucking whispering back there? He's like, he's like upset. He's upset that he couldn't I mean, fucking you betray him. You did call him out. I did. Damn, people are mad at me now. <laughs> people are mad that I cock-blocked you. Can you hear the sound for a second? It's not going to fit, dude. I don't have that tiny of a head. You do like, have a tiny head. People always say I got a tiny I mean, head, but like... It fits. It fit, this fits? You, you think this fits? It's not even fitting that's my that's hair, bro. So you're living here in Austin and you go back and forth from L.A.? No, here. no, no. I just live in L.A. This is my first time in Austin. I've only, really? really? yeah. only been to, to uh, Dallas before this, and Dallas is dog shit. Sorry. You like it? It's fucking boring as hell, dude. You like it? No, it's for old people. It's a little part of town, I guess you're in, because they have like the deep elm section, which is. I actually never, yeah, I went with my family, so it wasn't. We were meeting my brother who was living in Oklahoma at the time. And that's a whole state that's dark shit in comparison to Texas and Oklahoma. I, I've only been through it like. Three oh, this times. is way too short. Yeah, you have like big and tall versions of this? Or? I do, but that it's is. It's a double XL. Arizona's kind of new Texas. Everyone's moving to Arizona, too. True. My forearms don't fit this. 
What, this yeah, is, I'm, a, I'm a yeah. soy ass liberal. What's going on? I can't even fit in these fucking Texan. Uh, you do have some Michael Phelps long arms. I was just though. about to say, yeah. what's happening? What's happening in Texas? The double XL. Well, it could be the mutated water that you guys drink. <laughs> yeah, I don't know <laughs> what it is. Just pipes. I mean, I didn't grow. Up I in mean, California. not in the Beverly Hills yeah. area. I will be honest. California sucks. Oh, yeah. oh shut up. Um, I'll be honest with you. He's from Oregon. It's worse. I like, Lake I like the Lake Tahoe area. Yeah. yeah. For fishing and yeah. Stuff. California's got spots. You know, it's too big of a city not to have something. LA. <laughs> Very I'm true. A, too much landmass, not for something to be I'm, I'm good. I'm a fan. I, I love. I love Actually, love technically, I kind of like the Californians coming here a little bit because it's kind of like that. It's kind of like that fat girl syndrome in high school, right? It's like everyone was like, "You're fat. You're ugly." Then, like when she's 25, she's like the hottest thing. And she, and, and it's That's like, awesome right now. Gives you, she only gives you the booty just to remind you of how much you made fun of her. <laughs> So that's kind of that's kind of what I view it as. Like I like you guys eating our food and drinking our water because it's a slight <laughs> reminder of like you guys are dicks. You were dicks and now you have to eat this food. Now that's you a, have to drink our water. I, I was a New Yorker. I, I got no dog in this. Time, I but. kind of like it in that respect. It's just funny because like I'm gonna tell you right now. All the things that the, the, that you uh, know about California is happening in Austin in like. Mega speed because that's what happens when more development so, occurs. So what's the common denominator in that? What do you think, liberals? Le leadership. What? I mean, yeah, but it doesn't matter because ultimately, if two football teams play the exact same and one doesn't, who do you look at? You look at the coaching. And that that's a big. No, no, no. Coaching is a massive issue. But the, but the real issue is the real issue is both sides don't give a fuck about you. That's the whole point. Well, absolutely. Liberals don't. Republicans don't. But then Republicans will at least turn around and be like, yeah, I'm. I'm going to tell it like it is, like but, Donald but, Trump, but and then everyone, rob you blind but regardless. Before everyone cared about us, I was able to get a house for 180000 Yeah. Now everyone cares about us, and I have to spend but that's the But that's like across the board. That's just the economic reality. You know what I'm saying? Because, I mean, let's be honest. When, you, when you're down through L.A., how many guys do you see like me walking around saying, I just moved here. It's great. I'm never leaving. Because, um, because when we piss our bed, we change our sheets and we fix it. We don't, we don't just go to the next bed. Not the power grid, but yes, I know what you mean. You know but, what I mean? And that's probably more the common folk than the rich people who can. Like, Texans are a little bit more like we piss our beds, we change our sheets, we fix them. We don't I mean, Texas is there. run by a lot of rich folk. I'm just going to let you know. If it's you're, one of the richest states out there. Yeah, it's, it's all, it's, it's rich Houston, folk, Houston it's rich folk who wear huh? belt buckles to make it seem like he's like you working at uh, fucking Cavender's when he's not. He's making $7 million a year. That's why, remember, what was that fucking oil dude? There's like an oil baron who did not want to have a fracking well in his backyard. And he petitioned his local government not to make sure that he, he didn't fucking ruin his own, you know. I still don't really like fracking, but the pipeline was very he didn't, he didn't He didn't want fracking in his own backyard. Why? Because he, he doesn't give a fuck if it's fracking in a poor person's backyard. He just doesn't want it on his own. Well, it's no, di it's no different than like Mayor Adler here. He don't want the homeless people around his neighborhoods, and they don't want him on the... On the uh, on the state capital uh, lawn, but, every, but everyone else's house is okay. I think they had a really interesting initiative in Austin originally with like um, putting homeless people into hotels. Yeah, they're, they're trying. To do that. that was that was great. It's yeah. like hotels were empty. Yeah. It makes fucking sense. They like, bought they bought a few of them, but they just haven't gone through with that too long. Because yeah. they, they knew on this next vote well, that Texans were going to vote against it. So now that they now that we reversed the camping there, they do have to find some like one to go. The camping shit is so stupid. We do it in LA too. It's really dumb. They need shelter. They don't need fucking an area to camp. Right. You know what I mean? Nobody wants yeah, to fucking agree. live in a camp. Ahora? <laughs> anyway. Pronto? Unless you're, Ahora? Unless you're one of those like granola yeah. liberals. Hey, yeah. walk over here. So with you know, I, I love this. I will rock the fuck out of this. <clears throat> oh, the arms are long on this. Oh, this is perfect. Oh my god. See, these are like a goddamn globe, brother. This is good. This is, I think this is it. Dude, it actually kind of fits you. Yeah. It does look good, though, doesn't it? Oh, yeah, it's dude. maybe just a little short, but not bad. My arms are really arms. strong enough, yeah. You got long arms. God, look, you're dripped out. Mm. 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 All I need is a fucking... All I need is a hat, dude. One of these, dude. God. Damn. Okay, we need to change the pants, though. This is perfect. Right. It's fit me. Seven and three eighths. You gonna get that shirt or what? I'm gonna get the fuck out of the shirt for sure. I just need a hat, this shirt, and I guess pants too. I don't have pants. You getting those out of our boots or what? 
Nah. I'll, I'll go get the boost with you tomorrow. That's what I'm saying. I'm trying to get some steel tip. I just, I look like a like a corrupt city commissioner or something. <laughs> you do. Yeah. No, they look like a flag. I mean, it is a flag. You look good with it. No, like, you could be the flag. Like, if you had to go there and wave your arms, you could be the flag. Put you on the flagpole. Almost got it. You got it. You got it. Almost got it. Oh, we're almost there. You want me to do it? You got it. I got it. There we go. Okay. There we go. Are you scared go. about pick up the mask or mask it? <laughs> yeah. You want to touch Lick it. I have enough China virus. This wall line. Oh, you China virus. <laughs> 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 okay. All right. We got this. <laughs> I know you've heard all that. That's oh, I know. I have. Came from the Wuhan lab. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Level four lockdown. That's right. Lab. It was fit. Yeah. Just it was happened. made in China. Just, just, just happened to take out one That's of the hottest you guys told me. Yeah. I think probably should have been able to deal with it a little bit better. We tried to close the So this is a cord. There's a there's a live view here. Which we didn't just yeah. So yeah, it uses it. It takes a bunch of um, modems and connects all the cell towers and feeds them all into into this. Yeah. And lived in China. But yeah. Like during COVID, and then he came into America. We didn't like stop the flights coming in because obviously, if you're an American, you can still come into America, right? So he came to America, didn't have COVID for like a year, got it in Christmas. His mom doesn't believe in COVID and went and got it during Christmas and then gave it to the whole family. Are you gonna get vaccinated? Yeah, I don't. I'm fucking super bad. I don't give a shit. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. For, for, for a disease that has a 99 point. So, so this is my weekend job. You know what I do Monday through Friday? I work for the Texas State Health Department. Okay. So what? What do you do for the Texas? I mean, finance. I pay all the bills. Oh. Okay. Mm. So all the, all the medical and all the uh, like hazards. So water damage, flooding, you know, mm. and, 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 all, all basically all the bills that come through on state funds and federal funds. Okay. And uh, you don't want to take the vaccine, you don't believe in it, or do you just think it's? It's not like, that I don't believe in it. I just, I just don't. You know, I don't, I don't take the flu shot. I've never really had the flu. Really flu shot. And as far as COVID, I mean, it's like one of those things where it's like, if you have underlying health condition issues, that's cool. But it still has a ninety-nine point eight percent recovery rate. You know what my allergies go to help both of us actually is if we had that uh, local heart. That's why I sound like this right now. Mold allergies. That's why we got issues right now because we got allergies. Yeah. Does anybody dress like this? What's that? Anybody dress like this? Anybody dress like you yeah, here? In Austin? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, oh yeah. All right. Downtown, Austin, bro. Okay. I, well, I was wondering. Well, this is LA drip right here, is what Will told me. But you gotta think too. The fashion trends have all kind of gone a little bit like. To the left? No, they're like oh. a little bit more like Western. Oh, oh yeah, that's like, true. Like, like, you're right. Like, you're right. Listen, here's yeah. what you need. Mm. You got to get yourself one of these hat jacks. Mm -hmm. You're going to pair that with some hat stiffener. Mm -hmm. Throw some hat dust in there. That's right. And you're going to need a hat sponge and a hat brush. Mm. That's routine daily maintenance. If you're going to get your, if you want El Presidente, you got to treat that like, you know, prize it is. Is that what you got to do every day? That's right. Every day, make your hat look good. I know a lot of gentlemen don't use a hat jack. Well, I know. The brim collapses. Well, it makes it look like they got a dent in their head. That's right. Well, you know what? That's the punishment you 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 deserve when you don't get all the fixings with your hat. This is dope. Yeah, this, no, is, this, this is sick. sick. It's Kismet. It worked perfectly. I love this. I found something that worked. Hey, Woo! We're waiting for Sierra and then we're good. Why are you, you look uncomfortable? Yeah, because I'm a gay man in the most conservative store in the country. Okay, first of all, this is not the most conservative store in the country. This is like... I think I feel I'm black. Oh, that's true. I didn't. I mean, yeah, no. you guys both seem very uncomfortable. <laughs> I'm not uncomfortable. I just have to go to the bathroom. Okay. Drink a problem. I told you. Dude, it's like. Oh, my, it's going to It's again. always funny because it's like. You can tell it's a vibrate? Hello? Yeah, we're half, right. these, half these fucking songs are about yeah. like. Half these fucking songs are about like alcoholism yeah, like, and like fucking your cousin or like a very young girl. Did you? What? What? What were you gonna say? You just... I, I was I was gonna say you're just jealous until you said that last part, and then yeah. I...